Welcome to Getting Started with Libby on iPhone and iPad from the BK Public Library. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to download Libby and how to sign in with your library card. Before we begin, we'll go over a few tips and some information on what logins you'll need. Before we begin, it's important to make sure that your device is fully charged. This will make it easier in the long run. Also, go to your settings and make sure that your Wi-Fi is turned on and it's connected. Have all your logins and passwords on hand. Here are some of the logins you're going to need. In order to download the app to your iPad or iPhone, you're going to need your Apple ID and password. Libby is free, but you still have to log in. You're also going to need your library card number and your PIN. If you're unsure of what your card or PIN number are, please contact the library. Information is at the end of this presentation and down below. If you intend to put your items on your Kindle or send them to the Kindle app, you're going to need your Amazon ID and password. All right, let's start. First things first, let's download the Libby app. You're gonna start by going to the app store. It's that little blue square that I have on my screen. Once there, you will select search which is in the bottom right-hand corner and looks like a little magnifying glass. Mine is already selected. In the search bar, you're going to type in Libby, L-I-B-B-Y. You can see it's already auto-populated, but really any of these will work. Now, as you can see, I've got Libby by Overdrive with the little pink library icon. Over to the right hand side, you'll see that there's a cloud with an arrow. This indicates that I have downloaded the app previously, but it's not currently on my device. If you've never downloaded the app, there'll be a little button that says get. You'll hit that and then you'll input your Apple ID and password. If you already have the app somewhere on your device, the option will be open. So I'm going to select that and the app is going to download. Now we've got Libby on our device. Now that we have Libby on our device, it's time to open it up and log in. For this, you are going to need your Beecave Public Library card, as well as your PIN number. So let's start by opening up Libby. You're going to have this fabulous little welcome page that asks the question, do you have a library card? Theoretically, the answer should be yes. So let's select all search for library. I'm going to type in Beecave. And it indicates the Central Texas Digital Consortium, BK Public Library. Now there are a whole lot of other libraries in the consortium, so make sure that it says BK under the Texas, Central Texas Digital Consortium logo. Now let's enter our library card. Select BK Public Library highlighted in maroon. From here, you're going to enter your card number. I've already got mine saved, so I'm just going to paste it in here. I'm going to select next and then put my pin. And select sign in. Select next. And now you're logged in. If you're still having problems, you can feel free to contact the library. We're happy to help you with whatever problems you may have. Check out our other videos for more information about Libby and our other e resources. Thank you for watching this video. And thanks for being a BK Public Library patron.